The directional movement system is a trend indicator consisting of three lines. The average directional index in blue, the positive directional indicator which we have here in green, and the negative directional indicator which is red. The three lines are used together to determine the existence, direction, and strength of a trend, and to identify trend reversals and trigger buy or sell signals. The blue ADX line is used to assess whether the market is trending. High readings or an upward slope indicate a trending market, whereas low readings indicate the lack of a trend or range market. The DMI lines can be used together with the ADX line to determine the direction of a trend. If the positive DI line here in green is above the negative red DI line and the ADX line shows a high value or upward slope, this indicates an upwards trend. If the positive DI line is below the negative DI line with a high value or upward slope ADX, this indicates a downwards trend. The positive and negative DI lines converge when the trend is weakening and grow further apart as the trend strengthens. In addition to assessing trends, the three lines are also used to trigger trading signals. The ADX line forming a top and reversal indicates trend exhaustion, a good time to close positions that go with the direction of the trend. The positive green DI line crossing above the red negative DI line indicates a buy signal, while the positive DI line crossing below the negative DI line indicates a sell signal. Combined with an upward sloping or high rated ADX, signals on retracements of trends can also be placed. A low ADX reading signifies that the market is ranging and that oscillators and range trading strategies should be deployed.